Awesome. So today is about Elaine's Strength Skincare products, but it's also about ingredients. We're going to talk specifically about botanical ingredients, and we're going to talk about peptides in the skincare. So this skincare, mostly the products we're talking about today are retail skincare, but we do have a couple of professional products, uh, the two most popular ones that we sell. And again, this isn't our full line. This is just the best sellers. So if, you're, if you want to know more about the entire line, I encourage you to go to our website, elainestreamingskincare.com, and make sure that you review that so that you get a good overview of the entire breadth of our line. I think we have about 27 SKUs total. We're not going to do all those today because I want to bore you to tears. All right, so just a little bit about our brand. Uh, this is some media, some awards and accolades about us and some of the shows we've done. We have more than a few stockists across the country. This is just a very small list of those people. Uh, I want you to know that our main customer are those estheticians, are those retail spas, are those places that help people feel better about their skin. So it's important that you know that while we also sell retail directly to the clients you know, through our website, we also encourage relationships with spas because that's how we really make an impact. Because I can tell you, for example, when you talk to somebody like Practically Perfect up in Canton, Georgia, their clients love our products. And that's the way we get to connect with our products with our customers because they get the firsthand experience with people that sell it directly to them, which is the estheticians. Those are the people that make the sale, that make the relationship with the clients. So it's important that you guys know that we are always looking for people to build relationships with so that we can get out there and help people with their skin because we can. I mean, our products are some of the greatest I've ever seen in skincare, and they really can help people with a variety of skincare issues. So this is just a little bit about what we've done and where we've been featured. Um, and look out for us at like Face and Body. We just did Face and Body in Georgia a couple of months ago, and before COVID, obviously. And that was a fantastic opportunity for us. We did a main stage presentation, we had a booth, and we did a supplier class. So we're always there, as, if we can be, at shows. So look for us there and come out and meet us. We'd love to talk to you. So for those who don't know Elaine personally, you maybe have been to some of her webinars yet. I always like to talk about her backstory because I feel like it's an important part of the skincare journey that we take every day when we come to work. And Elaine's been doing this for about 25 years plus now. She started in the spa industry in resort spas back in South Africa. And she moved over here to the United States and she started the Elaine Sterling Institute. But not only on top of that, she was a single mom. She's beat cancer twice. So what I want you to take away from that is being cancer twice taught her about the body and taught her that the first sign of disease is inflammation. So when we talk about our skincare, the thing we don't wanna do is inflame the skin or have any kind of pro-inflammatory ingredients in our skincare. Our skincare is about creating positive change in the skin without causing undue damage or irritation to the skin. So that's why it's important to talk about her journey and her beating cancer because it helped her understand the physiologically, physiological effects of skincare and how the body works and basically what we want to avoid when people put skincare on their body. Um, and Elaine is well known in the industry. So her skincare line is formulated every day to make sure that it can basically be the best it can be. There's no added you know, parabens, there's no sulfates, and we make sure that everything that we do, again, is focused on the end game, which is creating positive results in the skin. So just a little bit about Elaine. And again, you've met her already in some of the webinars, but this is just a little bit backstory about her. Um, her passion shows through in the skincare line, and again, it works. So real quick, just an overview. Again, we are made here in the USA. Woo, we love that, right? We're not private label. That's really important to talk about. Uh, hopefully you all are familiar with what private label means. Uh, it means that someone has made their skincare for them and they put their label on it. We don't do that. Our lab is in Baton Rouge, Louisiana. And currently right now they are making medical grade supplies and equipment for hospitals during the COVID crisis. So our supply chain is a little slow right now. We're waiting on a order for micro C exfoliant and it's taking them a little bit longer, but understandably so. But what I love about that is that we, you know, we go out there, we meet with the chemists, we go over product samples, we always test everything that we are going to create. We're working right now on a new product that's coming out very soon. It's a new version of our chemical free SPF and I'm really excited about it. And there's a couple more on the horizon, but you know, we're small. We don't do a whole lot of products every year. We do about one to two products a year maximum that come out that are new because we take the time to make sure the ingredients are what we want them to be, that the products are effective, and that the end result for the consumer is going to be what they want and they're gonna see positive change in the skin. 
So like I mentioned, we don't have any parabens. We're not tested on animals. We are certified cruelty free, which is really important because I have four pets and I would never work for a brand that had uh, animal testing on the ingredients or the products themselves. Um, and then we use, like I said, a combination of botanicals and peptides, which is really, really important to talk about because those are the two things that will create change in the skin, right? Positive change without undue harm or irritation. All right, so just a few examples of those types of ingredients. So we have Camellia sinensis, which is green tea. We have Sigispecchia orientalis, which is a botanical extract, uh, anti-inflammatory. We have Centarium erythriae, another uh, anti-inflammatory extract. I'm gonna close this chat here so I can see everything. Uh, we have uva ursi, which is a botanical brightener. And then these are a few examples of our peptides. So what you'll notice is our peptides are all meristillated, which is really important to remember. So when you're using peptides, uh, and you're building peptides because what peptides are, are they're basically those building blocks, those amino acids, right? So all of our peptides are uh, meristillated, which means at the end of the peptide chain, they add on this fatty ester and it helps the skin uh, accept the peptide and it helps the skin accept what the peptide is telling it to do, whether it's building collagen, whether it's being a wrinkle reducer, whether it's being an anti-inflammatory, whatever the peptide is built to do, that extra meristillation is what helps the skin accept that and receive that peptide communication so much better. So none of our peptides are just in there as a peptide. They've been meristillated to be more effective and they all do different things and we'll get into that as we go through it. Just kidding. So this is my favorite slide, and it's also on our website. I actually had an email from someone today about this particular set of images, but I think this is so, so powerful, right? So we always, we talk about ingredients, we can talk about a lean story, we can talk about where I come from and, and why I'm excited to work here, but this is what you wanna see, right? Whether you're an esthetician or whether you're just someone at home who has a skincare issue, you want to see results. What's in it for you? right? We're creating positive change in the skin without inflammation. We always want to, again, reduce inflammation. So the top left, the top right, and the bottom left are three people that have used in different ways our skincare at home, their retail skincare products. And the bottom right is someone who's been uh, treated professionally by one of the estheticians who graduated from the Langston Institute, Ms. Regilyn Haywood. If you're on the, you're on the uh, presentation, Reg, hey, how you doing? Um, Reg and I presented the Face and Body Southeast recently together. And uh, this is just an example of not only at the at-home products working, but again, the professional products working. And you can see on the bottom right, I just love that one because it's so dramatic. This is a five month period, right? This is using both the emerald peel and the oxygen treatment together and creating, again, a reduction of inflammation. And even though we haven't technically reduced the scarring, it looks like we have because we've taken all of that redness and arrhythmia out of the skin. So the oxygen treatment is going in there and reducing and reducing the bacteria. And then the emerald peel is going in there and it's helping with pigmentation. It's helping exfoliate the skin. And then the top left is again, another one of my favorites because the hyperpigmentation is so, so dramatically reduced and it's only 30 days. What I also like to mention here in this specific slide is that our skincare is for all Fitzpatrick's, okay? So no matter the Fitzpatrick range, uh, you can use this skincare on yourself or on your client. Uh, which is really important because sometimes you'll have uh, inflammatory ingredients that will cause irritation in certain higher Fitzpatricks. And you don't have that issue. We can use that in all products, especially like our Mandelic Serum, which we'll talk about later. It's one of my favorites and can be used on most Fitzpatricks, which is what I love about it. And you, people see results. So I love that. All right. So now we're gonna get into the products. All right, so like I said, this is gonna be kind of dry. I do my best to keep it interesting. So stay with me if you can. Uh, what I want you to remember is that you're looking for solutions, right? Whether it's for you or for your clients, because at the end of the day, what's in it for you? What's in it for your client? We have to remember the end goal here. It's to help the skin be healthier. It's to help the skin look better. It's to help people feel more confident. So as we go through these products, I know it's not super exciting. I'll do my best to be as exciting as possible but just stay focused on the fact that these products do work and you've seen the results. I just showed you the results. So not too much into that, but first product is mouth cream cleanser. So I personally love this product because it is so versatile. If this is a great pre-cleanse, so this is definitely one you can use as a makeup remover. It's one for your more sensitive clients. And let's talk about what the ingredients are, right? What's really these key ingredients. So on the right, you'll notice these are the key ingredients that are in the product. This is not the full ingredient deck. If you're interested in the full ingredient deck, we do have that available. Uh, we probably are actually gonna post it on our website pretty soon here. We're gonna be doing a revamp of our website, which I'm super excited about. But these ingredients on the right are the ones that do the work. 
So we've got our witch hazel in here, which is a disinfectant. We have a rosehip oil, which is, a, excuse me, a conditioner. And then there's our green tea I talked about before, our botanical ingredient. Our allantoin is another botanical ingredient, which is anti-inflammatory, but still we have a peptide. So again, botanicals and peptides combined. So what I don't want you all to think is that we're a completely organic line or a completely natural line, because we're not that. We are a science line that brings in botanical ingredients that work. So we're, we're basically bringing you the best of both worlds, which is really, really important. Because I think if we didn't have these peptides, I think the skincare wouldn't be as effective as it could be. Because again, the peptides are the skin communicators that tell the skin what it needs. Now, this pept, I'm sorry, this cleanser specifically is not super foamy. It is nice and creamy. It can be tissued off, but again, it is a great pre-cleanse for the treatment room if you have a client that comes in with a lot of makeup and then you want to go in with an additional cleanse and you would use uh, like a gel cleanser, which is our next cleanser that's coming up here in a second. But as you can see, these ingredients specifically are again, aimed at being anti-inflammatory, soothing, but effective at the same time. We don't want to overdry the skin, and we definitely, especially if the skin is sensitive or dry already, and we want to make sure with that allantoin that we're calming the skin down and that we're reducing inflammation without adding you know, inflammation. So that's really important. So we have three cleanser we're talking about today. The first one was a mild cream, the second one's a daily gentle. So daily obviously means that we can use this daily. This is my favorite one to sell because it is so universal. This would be the one you'd follow up with the mild cream cleanser. So if you're in the treatment room, right, and you have a client that comes in, they have a full face of makeup, or they're super oily, or they just, you know, you feel like you really need to do a deeper cleanse, you're gonna go in with that mild cream cleanser for the pre-cleanse, then you're gonna go in with the daily gentle cleanser for your final cleanse before you go into your toning or whatever the situation is, if you're exfoliating, you're masking, this is gonna be that final cleanse that's really gonna go in there and, and go a little bit deeper. Again, still anti-inflammatory. I can't talk more about that. Our, one of our mottos is first do no harm, right? So we're not gonna, again, we're not gonna cause irritation. We're not gonna have any pro-inflammatory ingredients. Even our peptides are not pro-inflammatory. We would never have something like that in our products because we don't wanna cause inflammation. So you can see, again, we have an ingredient story here. This is a, it has almost like a, a fruity smell to it, which I love. It's, it's, a, it's borderline like botanical and fruity, but it's light, so it's not super heavy. And again, it's a gel cleanser. It foams up a little tiny bit and it's a great cleanse. You can do a double cleanse with this one if you want to on a client's skin to get that super squeaky clean before a peel. Uh, it's, it's very versatile. It's not gonna overdry the skin. It does have that glycerin in there, as you can see on the right, which is the humectant that helps hold water. And again, there's our allantoin, which is anti-inflammatory. There's our green tea, which is our antioxidant. And again, we all know how important antioxidants are for reducing your radical activity in the skin and helping the skin stay healthy and hydrated and reduce the look of fine lines and wrinkles. Uh, we all know what uh, free radicals do, right? They basically attack the skin. It's a breakdown of the skin's molecular, molecular structure, which is what we don't want, right? We want to make sure we're keeping that activity at bay because uh, skin that's been attacked by free radical activity, it looks dry, it looks irritated, it can look wrinkly, it can even cause acne. There's so many side effects of free radical activity we want to avoid. So that's why antioxidants are so important in our line and in this gentle cleanser. Now remember, it does have a peptide in here, which is fantastic, okay? But peptides only last uh, so long in a cleanser, we're gonna rinse them off. But we have peptides in our additional products that I'll talk about that are super effective. But it is nice to at least get that in the cleanser. So again, you're getting the most out of each step of the skincare, which is why your clients are gonna love to hear. They're gonna love to hear that their cleanser is starting that kind of skincare journey for them. And then it ends with whatever moisturizer and SPF they decide to use, which hopefully is ours. So, and don't forget y'all, if you have questions, use the Q&A button, I will get to them, or Elaine will get to them at the end of this presentation, okay? I don't think we're gonna run the full hour, which is great, so we should be able to get to everybody's questions and answers. So of our three cleansers, this is our final one, this is our clarifying skin wash, this is the one that I use at night. Uh, so I use the Deli Gentle in the morning and I use the clarifying skin wash at night. You know, why Josh, why do, you, why do you do that? Well, I'll tell you, uh, I tend to be a little oily and I live in Georgia. So that means that I'm out in, the, especially in like weather that's getting, we're getting now, it's getting a little more humid, it's getting a little warmer. For some reason, we're getting a cold snap. But before that, we were up in like the 80s during the day and the 70s at night. So I was feeling like my skin was just getting super oily already and just sweating and my pores were looking huge. And this is why I like the clarifying skin wash. I go through my day, whether I'm working out, I'm staying active, I'm walking around, I'm sweating. 
This particular skin wash is excellent for those who are dealing with that exact issue with oiliness, with excessive sebum production. And the salicylic acid in there, again, is our excellent, excellent exfoliant because it's a BHA, right? Our beta hydroxy acid. This is going into the pores and it's clearing up those dead skin and getting rid of that. It's helping exfoliate, which is one of the reasons uh, that we see people who have acne, it reduces those acne pustules. And what I love about this too, again, I'm gonna talk about it so much, you're gonna get sick of it if you haven't already. It's the first do no harm, the redu reduction of irritation. So even though we are, again, cleansing the skin, it's a little bit stronger with the salicylic acid, we still have the aloe juice in there to help reduce inflammation. We still have that green tea for its antioxidant properties, and we still have witch hazel for its disinfectant properties. Um, this can be used up to twice a day. Uh, what I recommend, especially if you're using it in the treatment room, is when you sell it to your client, I would start them out slow. So I would start them out using it once a week, I'm sorry, once a night, uh, at night only. So don't have them use it twice a day, start them out only in the evening time, see how that works for them, and then they can you know, increase it as the time goes on. But if you have a client who, again, who's dealing with acne, uh, someone who's dealing with redness in the skin, someone who's dealing with excessive oiliness, this is the way that they're going to start to see some results and get that deep clean without stripping the skin. Because we've all used cleansers and we all use cleansers on our clients that makes their skin feel dry and tight, which is what we don't want to do. We don't want to uh, undo that balance the skin has. Um, Elaine always talks about oily skin is healthy skin, right? So even if there is an excess amount of oil on the skin, we don't want to get rid of all of it, okay? We still want to keep the skin healthy. We still want to keep the skin ha happy. So again, when I sell this to someone or I talk to someone about this, I always make sure to tell them, start slow. And that should be the rule of thumb with any skincare ingredient. Uh, no matter what it is, whether it's a cleanser or a toner, your skin has to get used to it. It's a new set of ingredients, a new set of stimulation on the skin, and we wanna make sure we're giving the skin a chance to adapt and to learn, right? Especially like with peels. People who get peels, it's the same exact thing. Peels are an extreme example, but those ingredients, your skin needs time to train. So it's the same thing even on this smaller level with the clarifying skin wash, your skin needs time to train to get used to it. It may not be quite the learning curve like a peel, but still is necessary and important. So as you can see, we have three different cleansers. These are the most popular uh, cleansers that we sell and the only cleansers that we sell. But we sell so much of our cleansers because they work and clients do see results. And the estheticians love using them in the treatment room because they are so effective to use before a treatment, uh, before a peel, before a mask, an exfoliation, abrasion, whatever it is that you're doing in the treatment room, you can use all three of these cleansers com combined on almost any skin type, which is what I love. So our daily nutrient toner, it's our universal toner, and I will talk more about this because I love toners, and they are the missing link in skincare. I, th I feel like people are getting more knowledge about skincare toners, but I feel like there's still a lot of uh, mystery about them, and they're, and they're missing. Uh, we've all heard of the C brand uh, that sells the toner as part of their uh, three-step process. I can't say the name, but I think we all know what I'm talking about here, right? Uh, toners are vital to the skin. Uh, you have to think about when we started washing our bodies and our faces, we only started using water mm, two to 300 years ago. We People before that were using oils and they weren't even doing it at all. So skin that's now being exposed to water and there's so many things in our water now, it's unbalancing the pH of the skin. So how do we correct that? How do we do that after we've washed our face and rinsed it with water, we've unbalanced the pH, we use a toner. And the daily nutrient toner is excellent at, re at neutralizing the pH and bringing it back to where it should be. So that's how you talk to your client about it. You talk to your client and you say, look, I know it's an extra step, but it's so important to keep your skin healthy and to keep your, your pH balanced, right? That's how your skin stays healthy. That's how your skin stays nice and hydrated. It keeps that water oil balance uh, at this level it needs to be. And it also keeps the skin ready to accept the next step which could be a serum, which could be a moisturizer, some kind of treatment, whatever the client is using at home, it's important that they use a toner in between. And it comes in a, a spray bottle pump, which I love. So you can either spray it and mist over the face, you can use it throughout the day over makeup to rebalance the pH, or you could spray it on a cotton ball or a cotton swab, which is how I do it. And I wipe it over my face. And again, it does also help remove extra dirt and debris. But again, these ingredients, we're seeing the exact same ingredient story, which is something I wanna talk about really quickly. So uh, ingredients, when you have uh, the same ingredients and in products, it's really easy for the skin to accept and use them all together. Now, I'm not saying you can't use a length skincare within a skincare regimen with other products. I'm definitely not saying that. 
What I am saying though, is that the skin is going to be more readily accepting of products that have a similar ingredient story. So we're gonna be able to stack and layer these products so much more easily because they do share that core ingredient story. Because again, there's our cannonale, there's our green tea, there's our rosehip oil, things we've seen in the cleanser. So we're carrying that forward into the next step of our skincare routine, which is what I love about this product line, is that it's just so easy to use them all together. So just don't wanna make sure I forget to mention that. And this does have even, even just a toner, we still have a peptide in there, an antimicrobial peptide, which is very, very important. And again, first do no harm, anti-inflammation, beta-glucan is in there, which is a healing protein to help the skin calm down and heal while active things are happening, while the pH is being balanced, okay? And while we're making sure that we're keeping the skin calm and healthy and happy. That's the end goal always, right? Calm, helping, healthy, and happy. Never wanna be pro-inflammatory. Not here to Lance doing skincare anyways. So hopefully, if you know anything about our line, Elaine Spring Skin Care, you know about Micro C Exfoliant. This is out of stock right now. I'm so sorry. Uh, this is the one I mentioned that because our lab has changed over to creating medical supplies for hospitals right now, which is so important. We appreciate that. Uh, they have unfortunately slowed down their supply chain. So our Micro C Exfoliant order is uh, kind of waiting for it to be filled. Uh, it'll hopefully be here soon, but this is just it is definitely our number one bestseller. I think if I had to say we go out of stock of this one probably two times a year at, at the minimum, depending on um, you know how much activity we have on it, but it's definitely the one that I'm always reordering the most. Uh, what's great about this is that it can be used, again, all skin types. So whether you're dry, whether you're sensitive, uh, whether your client's got concerns about acne, uh, anyone can use this exfoliation step. And we do sell this in back bar. So it's not just a retail product. This is also a treatment that you can work into your, um, you know, your spa facials if you're an esthetician. And it really is an experience because you start with those crystals and they, they go across the skin very nicely and they don't feel harsh or they don't feel like gritty. They just feel like a very nice gentle exfoliation. And what's nice about those crystals is that they're not beads. They're not walnut shells. They are sodium bicarbonate crystals, which is just a fancy way of saying baking soda, right? So not harmful to the skin at all. And it's doing that exfoliation physically, but then you add that activator, which is that second step, that liquid and chemical exfoliation, and then you immediately feel this beautiful warming sensation, which is, I always love doing the demos at trade shows because as soon as I add that activator to someone's hand with the crystals on it already, they're like, oh my gosh, I can feel it working. And we know as skincare professionals, when someone feels a reaction on their skin, whether it's on the treatment room table or on their hand when you're demoing something, they're going to be excited. We wanna cause excitement in people. We, and people feel like things are working when they feel something happening. Now, that being said, there's always a flip side, right? If you have a client that is super sensitive or just feels like they don't want to experience that warming sensation happening on their skin, it, this can always be combined in like a little glass jar or a vial and mixed up together and applied as a mask. The client or the person still gets the benefit of that exfoliation without having to feel that chemical reaction happening on the skin. Uh, that gentle warming sensation though, most people love it and I know I personally do. It just makes your skin feel like something's going on. It's that lactic acid going in there and activating that vitamin C. Uh, as you can see, the uh, first ingredient here is vitamin C, which is an anti-inflammatory, but it's a stable version of vitamin C. It also does have peptides in here. So again, we don't leave those peptides behind. No matter where we're going, whether we're cleansing, toning, or even now exfoliating, those peptides are so so critical so we always want to make sure that we have them in our products because they do do so much for the skin they communicate with the skin and they help the skin either again produce collagen uh, reduce wrinkles whatever we built them to do and again they're more stellated for that extra fatty ester to be received by the skin so in the crystals we have the vitamin c we have that ascorbolinoleate this is a lipid soluble version of vitamin c which acts as an antioxidant which again Antioxidants are critical because we want to avoid free radical activity. And then we have our vitamin E, which is a healer and a brightener for the skin. And that's just in step number one, okay? When we go to step number two, we, again, we have a very similar story. We have our vitamin E, but now we're getting into that chemical exfoliation in both BHAs, which is our salicylic acid, and AHAs, which is our lactic acid. So we're getting two times that exfoliation and chemicals in that second step. And then malic acid even further is another alpha hydroxy, which helps exfoliate the skin, which is why, again, when we're doing exfoliation, we're only doing it at a minimum 
once a week, or maximum, I should say, once a week. Now, you can do this twice a week if you really feel like it's necessary for your client, uh, but I always recommend starting out slow. Again, very similar to when we're adjusting and training the skin, micro steaks for should be used once a week at night uh, before bedtime. And it really, it's just so lovely. I, I wish I could reach the computer screen and I give you guys a demo right now. But again, if you ever see this at a trade show, come by and I'll do a micro C exfoliant demonstration on your hand and you'll see what I mean. It's just so wonderful. And again, the experience, right? The experience and the end result, because when the client rinses this off at home or whether you remove it in the treat room on the table, they're gonna see more immediate brightening of the skin. They're gonna see a smoother and softer uh, skin and they're just gonna feel like their skin is, has a nice deep cleanse to it. But again, without stripping it or making it feel dry or tight. So again, anyone can use this uh, exfoliant, but it is uh, just great for people specifically who have issues with flaking. Um, those who are extra oily, they see the, the really dramatic result, which is what I love. We gotta do some water. I do this class for the Young Sterling Institute as well. I do it for the young estheticians who are getting their training and I always forget to have water today. I didn't forget, so I'm glad because I do tend to uh, talk a lot if you haven't noticed and I will uh, end up start running dry in the mouth. All right, so we're gonna get into some professional products here, right? Because I know, I just know, I have some licensed estheticians here on this webinar. So Elaine, you feel free to come back at any point in time because I'm going to want your help with this, but I can definitely start the conversation because our Pro C Peel is our definitely number one bestseller as far as peels goes. Between this one and the Emerald Peel, um, I would say that there's kind of like a battle royale because these do so well for the skin and they do amazing results. Now, what I want you to know is that there's two vials. Yeah, Josh. For... I'm here, Josh, but I just, um, can you see me? I can see you. Yeah, we can see you. Oh, okay, I just can't see myself. <laughs> oh no, we can see you. We can see oh, okay, you. Okay, awesome. I just wanted to make sure I was in on this um, as far oh, as my... Okay. So, so let me just, can I just chat that. a little bit about chemical peels and my sort of my philosophy? Yeah, go ahead, get into it. Okay, so um, I've been doing chemical peels for, some, before they even were around, probably like 15 years. And so my, my idea, because of first do no harm and most skin conditions are caused by an inflammatory response, even if it's hyperpigmentation. If I did my research on chemical peels, mild peels more often, you're going to see the same result as more aggressive peels. Now, there's no reason why, you know, quarterly you can't do your more aggressive peels, like if you're doing a VI peel or you're doing a, um, a Jesna, if that's something you want to do. Um, and it also depends on the Fitzpatrick scale and what you're trying to achieve. But these, these are peels are designed that you can actually partner them with my other peels, so you can make them more aggressive. But I always say progressive rather than aggressive, so that you um, can have one foot on the gas and one foot on the brake. So what's fabulous about my peels is you can use them alone, or you can create peel facials or peel treatments. So this is ascorbic acid. And so that, that's why it's two bottles, because you're gonna pour the activator into the powder, shake it up and keep it in the fridge and only use it when you need it. But you can partner it with the, either, what my, one of my favorite facials is called a double C facial, where you do the Vita C micro exfoliant first, and then you go ahead and do the C peel. Again, you're boosting, it's kind of like a booster. Another thing you can do is partner it with my other peels, my SLC peel or my Emerald peel. So it's, it's also, this, this peel is great to partner with microdermabrasion, dermaplaning, um, because it has the counter irritant and the anti-inflammatory. You can see that the beta-glucan in there is huge because it boosts the, um, the Langerhans cells, mostly in the spinosum layer, because again, I need, not only do I need to do a more of a triggering effect in the dermis as far as creating, um, you know, exfoliation, and cellular turnover and get the skin to think it's been wounded to heal, you'll see that all of my peels and my active ingredients always has a healing agent. So we're going to be able to do the, the, the um, anti-aging or the, the deep exfoliation, the chemical peeling, but we're gonna heal at the same time, right? Let's do no uh, harm. Yeah, exactly, and that's why my, 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 all of my products are, are geared towards um, preparing the skin for procedure in the treatment room and for post-procedure after the treatment and at home to heal, occlude, and boost the skin's own immune system. Because that's what we're trying to do. We're trying to set, get our skin. Everybody remarks on my skin. The only skincare products I use are mine. And, you know, I have a lot of reds in my skin. 
So it's all about, you know, reducing that inflammation in the tissue, even with hyperpigmentation, because guess what? It's that inflammation in the, in the epidermal dermal juncture, which is basically triggering that melanocyte activity. So you can see that to prepare the skin, we need tyrosinase inhibitors, then we need our, our peels, and then afterwards we need our anti-inflammatory, our tyrosinase inhibitors, and to include, and also our protection of the skin with the SPF, that's why I have the chem-free SPF. So, you know, it's, and we also have our BB creams, etc. So you can just see how I've got two anti-inflammatories in the peel working with the peeling agent as well. And that's kind of powerful. So this peel is something that you could use every two weeks. So that's great because, you know, you're, if you do a, a, a more aggressive peel and there's six weeks of healing, you're only seeing your client every six weeks. So that's why my programs, my skincare programs have been geared towards um, the esthetician and be able to do these peels every two to four weeks. Love that. Well, you know, I don't think I have to say much else other than just knowing that the, the reason, you talked about the reason we have two bottles, right? Like why we separated them? Right, because um, scorbic abscess is not stable. That's why mostly we use MAP and SAP you can, um, in, in our products. But when I've got ascorbic acid here, I've got ingredients to protect the ascorbic acid. And this is when you can see that I've, I've um, separated the two so we could keep it in the fridge. Um, and and it, like I said, it's also great as a quick peel before dermoplaning and a quick peel before your microdermabrasion. So I kind of like that, the two, like I said, and the, my double C facial with the vitamin C microexfoliant and then the pro, the pro C is just fabulous. And, so don't show, for, yeah. and don't forget everyone, we do have more peels on this. This is just one example because we don't have time to talk about the full range in an hour. It would take us way longer than that to go over the entire skincare range. But if you have questions, uh, make sure to go to alanceoneskincare.com and, and look up those peels. Because again, we have the emerald peel, we have the, uh, T, the SLC peel. Those aren't just, the, this isn't just the only peel we have. Oh, um, and then now, one more thing about the, 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 the C peel and the SLC peel, it's anhydrous. What oh, that yeah. means is, is that it's activated by water. So it's slightly different where you do a flash system when you activate with three wet aesthetic wipes. And why do I do that? Again, I like control. I'm a control freak, my personality. So I don't know what you're talking about. I know. So when you have control in your treatment room um, and, and on what's happening on your client's skin and the tissue response, that, 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 that gives me comfort. Um, so I'm able to use this as a mild peel and I have a way to boost it to a more med medical grade peel when I'm combining it as a tri-peel with the SLC or with some of my, my machines. So let's talk about, I'm doing a, a demo here. I'm gonna share with everybody on this product. I have it here in my hand. Uh, talk about the oxygen treatment, because this is, I mean, this is by far our best selling professional treatment that we do, for sure. Right, so again, with you know doing no harm and um, non-irritation, um, I don't like um, certain ingredients I don't use. It doesn't mean there's anything wrong with it, but I'm not a benzoyl peroxide cream. I look at what happens to the tissue, to the liver, um, and different things when we use ingredients. So this is a stabilized form of hydrogen peroxide in a cream base, but it has an, an enzyme, a catalase enzyme, that I, causes a burst of oxygen. Did you like my Steven Spielberg sound effects? Causes a, causes a, um, a reaction, and, on, and what happens is that it creates a burst of oxygen. I, I call it yoga in a jar. So what happens when you, when you do yoga, or this new method that my daughter's got me doing, which is kind of like hyperventilating. Well, the, the um, Romhoff method it's called. Well, the, um, the tissues, the oxygen is sent to the tissue and the waste is removed. And then when you send oxygen, and plus as we know, bacteria can't live in the presence of oxygen, which is why this is so great for uh, uh, destruction of bacteria on the skin, those P bacterias. It's also excellent um, for um, bringing life into the skin and oxygenating the tissue. So it, it's great for um, making your extractions easier. It's fantastic for sterilizing the skin or sanitizing the skin after your, you know, with your extractions. Um, you can use it on any skin type. So I have mild rosacea, but give, you know, doing a mild um, triggering of that wounding with rosacea will also help it heal. So you can do this on its own called the oxygen facial, but you can also do it with um, 
combining it with other services like your vitamin C peel, your emerald peel to create um, a brightening treatment and create um, acne treatments as well. So, you know, you've got one product and right out of that one product, you can create three facials. So that's important as well, you know, and you really use, you, you sort of activate it on Josh's hand, but he probably only used a P or two P sizes with the activator. And the immediate brightening on the skin is incredible. Okay, here we go. I gotta show everybody. So I'm gonna, okay. what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stop my screen share, okay? Can everybody see me okay? Can everybody see me all right in yep. the chat? I wanna make sure they can still see me. I don't know if, I don't know if they can see me. No, I can see you, doesn't that matter? <laughs> Okay, they can see me. All right, so I have taken my step number one for my oxygen treatment. All right, this is the cream. We start with this, we put this on the face. Um, I, I am a more generous layer than Elaine does. When I do a demo of this, I always like to do a very nice thick layer. And then I added the activator step that Elaine talked about, okay? Now you can see right there how foamy and thick it got. I, again, I'm very heavy handed with it when I do demos because I love. But again, look at my two hands, right? So now I'm going to remove, this has been on my hand now for about five minutes or so, maybe a little bit longer. And I, oh my God, I just love showing people this. It's my favorite thing. Um, let me, it's dramatic, which is what I love about it. Are you ready for the reveal? All right, here we go. Look at that. Look at the two hands. You can see the comparison, how bright, you can even see the line on my hand, I know this lighting is terrible, but you can see right there, just the delineation of where I had that treatment, the immediate brightening, right there, you can see how dramatic that is, right? Like when you see that, when a client sees that on their skin, when you see that in the treatment room, I mean, look at all the redness, it's gone. Like, look at that. You can see it more dramatic now because I dried it off. So I always love to demo that particular one. I just did my hand here next to my face. Um, it's an incredible treatment, not only for the fact that, as Elaine mentioned, you're getting that healing, you're getting that reduction of bacteria. Now put your two hands like that, because now you can really see it. There you go. Yeah, thanks. I mean, it, I love this product because, again, what's in it for the client, right? The client is going to trust you to do the best thing, but, and they don't see results. What's the point, right? They're going to be like, oh, okay, that's nice. But when they see something like this on their skin, you got them, they are hooked. They're coming back to you next time for sure. And then they're gonna see with those, those acne clients, then they have those pustule reduction. I always love to uh, tell someone, I've had a lot of people who ask me about peels uh, or clients who have active acne. I always tell them to start with the oxygen to reduce those acne pustules. And then once that's gone, you can go in with your peels and your microdermal abrasions. Um, and so a couple of things I wanted to tell you was a couple of ways to do those facials because I'm, I'm an esthetician that loves to create like bespoke facials, customized facials. So you can, once you've activated, you can put three strips of plastic over the, like saran wrap, not over the eyes and nose or mouth, but three strips to occlude the oxygen into the skin for five minutes. There's two other ways that I like to use it. I love to use it with a um, ultrasound spatula and kind of shave it off that's really cool because then you're getting some exfoliation with the oxygen. I've also used my high frequency through it. So there's different ways to create this and you don't have to put um, saran wrap on it either, you know, I um, uh, but, but I, again, I like to, the more steps I have in my facial, the more value and you only need to leave it on the skin naught to five minutes because that burst of oxygen, you, you know, you don't need to leave it on too long. So, so more than five minutes is not, you know, and you can also create um, masking facials because this is like a mask once you've activated. So Absolutely. everything of mine is kind of like a mask. The vitamin C micro exfoliant, if you whip that up, it becomes a mask. This is a mask. So you can create, I have a beautiful masking facial. I don't know if, um, I don't know if Josh has his protocols, but I can send it to you. So I, I create like fabulous protocols and we've done it all for you. All of the protocols are in Elaine Sunny Skincare already written for you. And so you can just pop, add those, those facials onto your menu really quickly. And it's not sold for retail. So it's just professional. So your clients can't do this at home. Nope. So that's kind of nice. The peels and the oxygen are purely back bar. And we're very small, you know, I don't have a lot of you know so it's 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 such a boutique um indie line but honestly when when spas and when estheticians and when the public your, your clients use my skincare there's nothing else because of the way i've combined those those anti-inflammatory those counter irritant botanicals and botanicals on, on its own aren't going to work i mean they work a little bit but you know, when you put the peptide with it, 
you kind of supercharge it. It's kind of turning it into one of Josh's favorite um, characters, uh, like Superman or Spider Man. <laughs> <laughs> I love my superheroes. Yes, it's turning the 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 ingredient into a superhero. So that's what my peptides are doing. And 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 the reason why there's different ones is one is for bacteria, one is for speeding up cellular turnover, one is for growing collagen, one is for so sometimes we're combining different ones as well. So I, I had to show everybody this one because I knew when we went over oxygen, the only way for me to show you was to actually show you. So we can talk, like I said, we can talk about it all day, but until you see results like this and your clients, again, will be amazed. So we have a couple more to go over. So I'm going to restart the slideshow and then we can take some Q&A because we're going to, I didn't realize how uh, we were going to run out of time. I've been so excited. So let me share my screen here and I'll continue on. PowerPoint share and we're going to start the slideshow. Okay, so getting back into it, just a couple more things to go over. Uh, so uh, again, these are our best sellers. This is the complete line. So when you're ready to learn about the entire line, please go to elainestrengthskincare.com. You can email me specifically if you have any questions. I'm happy to recommend products to you uh, at josh at So our detox mask. Uh, this is a lovely mask, and this is what I love to sell to people because it is for all skin types. So this mask specifically can be used by nearly anyone. The only person I would not use this mask for would be an extra, extra dry person or a very, very, very sensitive person. Uh, what I love about the detox mask is that the word detox, while it does mean that we're obviously removing impurities, kale and clay is a balancing clay. So it's not like those other clays, those red clays or those um, charcoal clays where it's all it does is remove. Kale and clay's main uh, goal is to balance the skin. So again, talking about first do no harm and not causing an undue irritation, we don't want to strip the skin and we definitely don't want the skin to be dehydrated by a mask like this. So while it's balancing, and removing impurities, we also still have uh, vitamin C in here. We have an ascorbyl linoleate, which is a soluble form of vitamin C. We saw that in our, uh, our uh, exfoliant, our micro C exfoliant. So it's improving collagen, even while we're doing this detoxification and imbalancing of the skin. And there's a peptide in there that's helping to uh, help produce collagen. So this is uh, a mask that's unlike any out there, which is why I love it so much. And we are sold out of it right now. I know you guys probably hate me. I'm selling you on something we don't even have to sell you. Um, but the good news is, is that when it's back in stock, which will be soon, uh, you again can sell this to nearly anyone. I would definitely recommend working it into a facial um, in your treatment room because when they experience it on the skin and they feel the softness of the dry down, it doesn't have a crackly dry down, it has a very soft dry down. I have to interrupt you again. Oh, yeah. Go ahead. The, the, the detox mask, what's wonderful about it, because you know I'm an esthetician, usually you when are? You're, I have no idea. Yeah, I know. I'm an ST bestie. Usually when you when you apply the clay mask, it gets so dry and then you have to use like some sort of heated towel to remove it, which is not what you're supposed to do at the end of the facial. This goes on very creamy mm -hmm. and is removed very easily. And you use such a thin layer because of the potent ingredients. So it's 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 unlike the other clay mask you may have used in your treatment room that sticks to the skin and you're having to rub on the skin to remove the mask and you use such a tiny bit as well. Yeah. And it's, so I just wanted to like throw that in there. Yeah, I was gonna say the thing we don't wanna do is we, we don't need to use a thick layer of this. You should still see the skin under the under the mask. So you'll still notice the skin under there. Uh, it won't be like that complete opaque covering that, you, that you're used to with other clay masks. Okay, so our HA serum, this is one of Elaine's favorite. This is a booster for hydration, right? This is for our, our anti-aging clients, the ones who start, you know, want to see reduction of fine lines and wrinkles. They want to see a boost in hydration. This is also a great post-procedure uh, for someone who's had microneedling and they need the skin to stay hydrated because the skin, obviously, while it's healing, it needs hydration to do so. Um, while it's doing that, it's also helping to heal the skin. It does have that rosehip oil, which is conditioner. It does have that allantoin, which is an anti-inflammatory. Um, it still has peptides in there, right? So not only, again, are we soothing the skin, are we helping the skin with hydration, we're still helping the skin produce collagen and elastin while it's going through this healing process. We're getting that balance of those botanicals and those peptides together. And then we have that additional glycerin, which is drawing water into the skin, which is what we want. We want the skin to be hydrated and happy. Um, I always recommend this for my drier clients, again, post-procedure clients, and those, again, who want anti-aging. This is for someone who's probably noticing the beginnings of those fine lines and wrinkles. This is gonna help reduce those. 
Um, you know, sodium hyaluronate is an excellent anti-aging ingredient because it holds 1,000 times its weight in water. So plump, healthy, happy skin cells are the ones that are going to be the ones that don't look old, right? We don't want our skin to be dry or crepey because we notice wrinkles and we notice the skin looking, you know, dull or dry when it's dehydrated. So HA serum is an excellent one to use in between toning and moisturizing to help boost that moisture, to help boost collagen production and to reduce the look of fine lines and wrinkles. And I, we, I think we sell this is probably between this one and our Pure C is probably one of our, again, number one bestsellers for serums go. Uh, because our client is a more mature client. You know, people who come into our, our spa rooms are generally speaking a little bit more mature. And they're getting treatments like a microneedling that are more severe and they need more healing time. And this is what helps shorten that healing time. I use this one. I normally wouldn't use an HA serum, but when I get microneedling done at our spa here in Atlanta, I 100% use the HA serum during those few days after to help speed up my healing and keep my skin hydrated because even my skin when it's oily still, again, needs health, healthy hydration while it's going through a healing process after something like a microneedling. Uh, again, Elaine always says, healthy skin, uh, oily skin is healthy skin, so don't be afraid of oil. And I love the HA serum for me when I'm going through a post microneedling. So again, an excellent, excellent, and a very lightweight too. Um, all of our serums are micronized, so they absorb into the skin very, very quickly, and they're very, very effective. So I mentioned Pure C, right? So Pure C serum is, again, head to head with our uh, HA serum as part of our, our best sellers. Uh, Pure C, again, what do you think's in here, right? Vitamin C, that's our MAP, our magnesium ascorbyl phosphate that Elaine mentioned before. It's that stable, non-irritating form of vitamin C. This serum was used by the gentleman from our before and afters, if you remember in the beginning of the presentation, he was using this on that uh, hyperpigmentation on his skin, and this helps with that. It's a brightening serum. It helps the skin look more even toned. It's lightweight, again, micronized particles, so it absorbs into the skin very easily. And you can see we have two botanical uh, ingredients in here that are very effective at brightening the skin, but also helping to reduce um, inflammation and produce collagen. That's the Sigus specchia orientalis there and the uva ursi. I love uva ursi. It's, it's one of my favorite ingredients because it's helping to brighten the skin naturally by, by helping tyrosinase activity slow down. So instead of going in there and bleaching the skin, which can be an irritant for sure, or just basically helping the skin calm that tyrosinase activity and reduce melanin production. So when we go in there, we, we're putting this on in between our toner and between our moisturizer for that boost of anti-inflammation, for that boost of collagen production, and for evening out skin tone and reducing pigmentation. I love this one because it can be used by almost any skin type. Even your acne clients can use this before they use their moisturizer. And it does help, again, reduce that redness and inflammation on top of the brightening and evening out. Because when we have clients who have acne, a lot of times they have pigmentation issues because they have scarring because they pick, right? I mean, I know I've been guilty of that because I used to have really bad acne and I would pick and it would cause dark marks on my skin. And this helps reduce those as well. So again, a universal serum almost anyone can use. Um, unlike the HA, which is again more targeted towards specifically your older, more mature, and maybe dehydrated clients, this one is pretty universal. And again, you can use this in the treatment room and layer it in with other vitamin C treatments like our micro C exfoliant to really boost that vitamin C um, absorption into the skin because it is so critical to skin health and to helping the skin look so beautiful. Okay, last serum. This is my baby. I use this one personally at home. Uh, I think I'm at twice a week now. This is our Mandelic Serum. Now again, remembering what I talked about in the very beginning, our skincare is safe for all Fitzpatrick's and this is an excellent reason why, because we use Mandelic Serum. This molecule is similar in nature to glycolic, right? But glycolic can be irritating to our higher Fitzpatrick's and we don't want that. We don't want irritation, first do no harm. I can't talk enough about that. What I love about Mandelic is that anyone can use it. Okay, and I do mean anyone. I can talk about your dry skin types, your combination skin types. I can talk about your Fitzpatrick's one all the way to Fitzpatrick's five. Okay, so this can be your anti-aging serum. This can be your skin texture serum. This can be your acne serum. It's so universal and it works so well. Now, when I say that, it is strong, it is powerful. And uh, Elaine knows that when I first started using this, I, I may have not followed the instructions. I had just started working for her and I was just super excited to have a new product. So I took this home and I used it every night. And that was a mistake. What I will say is that this should be used to start once a week. It really is, if I had to compare it to a professional treatment, it really is, a, it's almost like an at-home peel at the end of the day. 
Uh, the texture of it is thick. And it does have a little bit of a tacky dry down. So for me as an oily person, I will not put a moisturizer on afterwards. I will just put this on after my toning and I will go to sleep and wake up with just beautiful skin. Um, it really does help also with people like me who have a lot of ingrown hair issues in the beard area. So those thicker skin clients, those clients who are acneic, they're gonna see a benefit from this. And uh, between you and me, it smells fantastic. If you haven't smelled it before, the grapefruit oil and the orange peel oil, not only are antibacterial and anti-acne, they are just make it smell so good and they're not um, you know, a synthetic fragrance. It's just the natural fragrance of those two oils. But I mean, just look at this long ingredient list. Obviously, Mandelic is our first one. It's got that pH of 3.5, it's 8%. Uh, and again, it's exfoliating, it's helping uh, even out the texture of the skin, it's helping to brighten the skin. It's got that lactic acid in there. But on top of all that, we still have our beta-glucan for healing. We still have our green tea for antioxidant properties, and we still have our rosehip oil. I talk again about that ingredient story that just follows through our entire product line that makes everything work together so wonderfully and makes the skin so receptive to everything so easily. So clients use an entire skincare regimen like maybe Miss Elaine Sterling does. All they see is beautiful skin and skin that's receptive to the things that are happening, which are positive change without irritation. So again, this is a universal serum, but again, powerful serum, almost like I said, an at-home peel that can be used by all skin types. And there's a multi-benefit situation here. I, I can't stress enough how much I love this product. And because I personally use it, I, I have a little special place for it in my heart. So definitely recommend trying it if you're looking for any of these benefits because it really does work. So our only eye ingredient, I'm sorry, our only eye product is our collagen eye. And I'm almost gonna run out of time here. So I'm gonna try to speed up for the end here. But Collagen Eye is our only eye product because it is so effective. It does, again, like our Mandelic Serum, it's a multi-benefit product. So if someone has issues with dark circles, if someone has issues with fine lines or wrinkles around the eye area, and even puffiness and inflammation, Collagen Eye is going to address all of those issues because of the way those complex ingredients work together. So if you'll notice, it has retinal palmitate in there. Now this is an interesting ingredient because it is a mix of retinol and a fatty ester. So this is a regenerative version of retinol without that irritation and undue uh, harshness that retinol can have on the skin. Now we still wanna make sure if someone's using this product, they're using SPF because that retinol still makes them photosensitive, but it is gonna reduce, again, that puffiness and inflammation. It's also gonna help the skin cells around the eye turn over and exfoliate more quickly to help reduce uh, wrinkles and reduce the look of fine lines as well. It does have peptides in there, which are going to help promote healing. And it does, I mean, look, at there's one, there's one there's a dipeptide, a tetrapeptide, and a pentapeptide in there. These are all helping to reduce inflammation and stimulate collagen, again, collagen eye, right? Stimulating collagen in the eye area is critical because the eye area is so sensitive and it's such thin skin and so delicate. It needs collagen and elastin production to stay hydrated, to stay firm, and to stay wrinkle, as wrinkle-free as we possibly can, right? Without going into having procedures. And then that glycerin is that added benefit because it's helping the skin stay hydrated and plump. Again, thick skin, hydrated skin is gonna reduce the look of those dark circles under the eye area. So this is an excellent eye serum and cream. Very similar to the Mandelic, I always recommend starting this out once to twice a week, only in the evening. And because of that photosens uh, photosensitivity that retinol can bring, we always wanna make sure our clients are using or we ourselves, if we're using this, are using this PF afterwards to protect the skin as it goes through the renewal process and it looks beautiful and healthy, protected from the sun. Wow, I had too many, pro I had too many slides, we're running out of time. So uh, this is a very complex product, but I will tell you that it is one of the second best sellers for our moisturizer. So it is a treatment moisturizer, it's brightening. If you have a client or you yourself are looking for a pigmentation uh, solution, this is it. Uh, the gentleman in our before and afters on the top left, he was also using this with the vitamin C exfoliant and the vitamin C serum. And this is our moisturizer that contains so many active ingredients. It does so much to reduce and uh, even out the skin's tone. So if you look in here, it just slowly, I mean, I think there's a total of six skin lighteners and brighteners in this product, which is amazing. I love this product because not only are they getting the benefit of evening out the skin tone and making the skin look so beautiful, they're still getting moisture, they're still getting anti-inflammatory, and they're also getting those antioxidant properties which are so critical to the skin. As I mentioned, antioxidants are key to keeping the skin healthy. So with those brighteners, with those lighteners, 
with that uva urzi, which is the key ingredient for that brightening, we still have the beta-glucan, which is helping heal the skin. We still have our acai extract, which is antioxidant. Uh, I mean, it's just an incredible lightweight moisturizer that does attack that pigmentation and reduces it so effectively. But again, if we're giving this to our client or if we ourselves are using this, which is a twice a day treatment, we always wanna make sure we're following with an SPF so we don't undo all that work we did. So this is, I just, I will say specifically for those who sell skincare, if you're an esthetician, you're hopefully selling a skincare. Uh, I always like this one because it's a shortcut. So if you have a client, what's in it for them, right? They don't wanna go home and use a bunch of different products. They don't wanna use the Pure C and Bright Me. They don't wanna use a skin brightener and a moisturizer. This is a one-two punch. They go home, they apply this after their toning, and they're getting all of those benefits of, pigment of pigmentation reduction with a moisturizer. So they don't have to do two steps. It comes down to one step and then they're finished. Outside of obviously an SPF during the daytime when they go out. But just clearing that path to purchase, I always talk about that when we're trying to make a sale. Because at the end of the day, right, we want to make a sale. Uh, this is a great way to do that because, again, you're taking it two steps down to one. So I just want to make sure I talk about that as well. Okay, how many we have left? We got three left. All right, we're gonna, I want Elaine to talk about Power Rescue really quick because this is her favorite product. And I feel like she does justice more than I do, honestly, because Power Rescue is like one of the oldest products in the line. Okay, so the most important thing about this product is that I call it a botanical hydrocortisone. So um, for people that have a lot of reds on the skin, if you're doing peels, microneedling, chemical peels, this is your post-procedure product. This is your power-packed, counter-irritant, anti-inflammatory, um, stabilized. You can see I'm using MAP in this, which is my stabilized, non-irritating form of vitamin C. Um, the vitamin C is going to protect the vitamin E. But we have ginger in this product as well. Um, and, and we have the Gisbecca and Centaurium in there, which are powerful both botanicals. And this, this is the, I mean, I've used this for years. And when you have the Caucasian skin types, when they age, you tend to see a lot more reds on the skin, um, hormonal fluctuations, um, as well as um, environmental. This is the go-to. When you have a client that says, I'm sensitive, everything breaks me out, I'm sensitive, I'm sensitized, or you see that thin redding skin, this is your go-to. Again, it is. you can use it with, I, all of my products are designed to be layered. So you can layer the, the serums and you can also layer the moisturizers. But this is a moisturizer and serum in one. And you need a, you know, you just need a, a small um, pump. But let's say in winter that my skin's a little drier, I do HA serum, power rescue, and then to, and then I do the um, intensive moisturizer. So I, I, I will in summer I may need less and then in winter I need more. But I cannot, my life, I, I cannot have not have this on my bathroom shelf. So this is this is the one that you really see the difference. Seeing, seeing and feeling difference, right? This is where you can see, this is, this is, this is because a lot of people are also hydrocortisone sensitive. So this is something that you can use that I feel is, is excellent. All right. There you go. Two left. Okay, so total everyday hydration. This is uh, very similar in, in nature when I say uh, similar. I'm talking about universal, right? So like our daily gentle cleanser, like our daily nutrient toner, total everyday hydration can be used by so many different skin types. Uh, the only skin type I wouldn't recommend it would be the extra, extra dry or your extra, extra oily. Those two extremes probably not get a super great benefit out of this product. Um, it is lightweight. It is a great moisturizer to use both day and night. And obviously we wanna make sure we're recommending this to our clients and giving them a sample of it on their hand because the, the texture of it, like our serums, is so wonderful and so lightweight that it absorbs into the skin very, very quickly. So it's not a heavy moisturizer, even though it is effective on the skin. When you look at this side here on the ingredients, it does have vitamin E in here. It does have that D-glucan, which is a healing protein. Sorry, my dog's excited because someone just dropped a package off of my front of my door. Um, hey, hush, hush now. Uh, it also does have macadamia oil, which is a very lightweight hydrator with, again, effective hydration without feeling heavy or thick on the skin. And it even does have a touch of peptides in there. We're going to help improve the elasticity of the skin by promoting keratin production with that mercillated peptide. So even though it's not a very high ingredient concentration of that peptide, it still is a small benefit while you're hydrating the skin and keeping it healthy and happy. Because we're wanting the skin to be healthy, happy, and hydrated which is why I love total everyday hydration.
So whether you're using it in the treatment room after a, uh, you know, they've done a facial, whether you're recommending it to your client in between their visits with you, they're going to love the feel of this. They're going to love their skin staying hydrated and healthy while getting those additional skincare benefits outside of just getting hydration. And it does have the um, amino acids in there, which are, again, helping stimulate the collagen and elastin production. I'm bringing all kinds of stuff to my front door right now. FedEx is just giving me everything. So uh, remember that this is a universal skincare product. It can be used by almost all skin types and it can be used both morning and night. And it, again, does not have that heavy feel, even though it's an effective hydrator with that beta-glucan, with that glycerin, with that macadamia oil, and not feeling greasy or sticky on the skin. It just absorbs in very, very beautifully. And last but not least, Again, we are getting a new formulation of this, but our current formulation is still fabulous, so don't get it twisted by any stretch of the imagination, it is our chem-free SPF. Now, you might wonder why we've called it that, and the reason why is because we don't have any chemicals in our SPF. We don't have any chemicals in this product. We've only used zinc oxide, which is a natural mineral-based sunscreen that basically is a physical block to those UV rays. Uh, what I love about this is that any skin type can use this, and at the end of the day, we want to protect our skin from those UVA and UVB rays. But we also get a little bit of a benefit because we have that pentapeptide in there, which is simulating collagen in the skin. So you're not only getting just protection from the sun, you're getting a little bit of anti-aging in this one as well. The zinc makes it a little bit thicker, a little bit more um, uh, of that like white texture to it. So you definitely want to warm it up in the skin before applying it to the skin, especially in your darker Fitzpatrick's, because we don't want that chalky or ashy look to the skin which is why our new Chem-Free SPF, which is coming out very soon, uh, has a more absorbed quickly feel to it and it won't create that same kind of white finish. But again, warming it up in the hands is an easy way to avoid that. And again, we don't use chemicals in our SPF because the maximum uh, SPF you need in your skincare is a 30. Other than anything above that is redundant. You can still get very effective protection from the sun with the maximum of SPF 30. And once you go above that SPF, you are going to go bring in those chemicals that can be harmful to the skin and harmful to the body's systems, which we don't want. Again, talk about it over and over again, but as I finish on this last product, first to no harm is our motto because we don't want to harm the skin or the body with, with our products or our ingredients. So that is the end of our presentation. And I think we're running over time a little tiny bit, but I think Elaine was answering those Q and A's while I was doing- I was. One of the big questions was the drop shipping, and I know you have a plan for that. And also, um, we, don't, we don't have any minimum orders, right? You can order, as, I think we just do free shipping if it's over a certain amount. Otherwise, if it's under a certain amount, we, we, we charge shipping, correct? Right. So uh, any minimum order over 150 gets free shipping. Uh, uh, below that, they would pay shipping, which usually isn't that much anyways, depending on the order size. Um, but, you know, we don't have minimums. We are small, as Elaine mentioned. So it, and when I say small, you're looking at it. It's me and Elaine, really. At the end of the day, there's just the two of us that are running this business behind the scenes, um, which, is, which is good and, you know, it can be a little stressful, but it's good at the end of the day because you know who you're dealing with. There's no middleman. There's no secret person packing your order in the middle of the night in some warehouse. It's, it's, it's me here in my kitchen right now. I actually sent out two orders today. So know that you have trust here with us. Uh, we work with a lot of small um, you know, businesses and a lot of estheticians by, who work by themselves and having conversations with them has helped show me that you know, I think there's a need out there for that connection and that truth in skincare and I think we provide that. And today was obviously all about that, was you know, pulling back that, that curtain because we had nothing to hide. Our ingredients are fantastic, our products do work and when clients and you yourself use them, you see results. When used the right way, I always like to tell the students at the school, when products are used the right way and they're recommended the right products, they're gonna see results with this product line. That's and how do, they, how do they sign up to be a pro so they can get their, their discount on the, um, the retail and, and get, get um, access to the wholesale pricing on so the- when you guys email special. me, uh, either email us or email skincare at Link Skincare with your license, uh, we'll set up a wholesale account or a wholesale website and I'll give you a password and a username and then you can go in there and start um, ordering your wholesale products, which means you get half off of the retail so that you can resell it and you get to be able to order the back bar, the peels, the oxygen treatment, because we saw that today. You want, I know everybody's ready to order that. I'm so excited to get those orders in. Um, and, so and also, they, we, we have the protocols on, on, in the back office and the marketing material that they can use on their um, websites and their menus, correct? 
absolutely. So uh, it will be, it's on the Wholesale website. So I'm going to put in the chat because someone just asked. So you can email skincare at Elaine Sterling Skincare. Dot com. Uh, email your license uh, to that email and tell us what you want. Um, I'm happy to have phone conversations with anybody who's interested in formulating, you know, a specific collection for their, you know, skincare room. Uh, we are now doing business. I'm happy to stay with the cryotherapy business here in Atlanta. They're carrying our line. Uh, they're carrying a very curated selection for their clients that makes sense for them. So if you would like to do that, if you would like to pick you know, a curation of a, of a line of our products to carry in your spa room to sell to your clients. I'm happy to recommend that. And we're not uh, sold on you. Amazon or any of those types of sites, right? So that way well, it's- The only way clients can get our skincare is either from our website or from you. So that makes it exclusive, it makes it small, and it makes it hard for them to get other, unless they're coming directly to you, uh, which is something you can, you know, position as a way to stay exclusive to your clients. And again, think about that oxygen treatment, think about the peel, they're only going to get that from you because they can't buy that, that's back bar only. So when you work that into a treatment, excuse me, my nose is itchy, when you work that into a treatment, that becomes something that they're going to come back to you for specifically, it helps build your business. And students can also buy the professional um, I would recommend that if you're doing chemical peels, the, the, the oxygen, um, the, the vitamin C peel is fine, but anything over that, I recommend that you do have liability insurance. And I know ASCP and other companies do have that, and that's real easy. My current students, if you want to purchase, you can purchase through Josh or from the retail area. We have the pro products in our retail area in um, Esthetique as well as, as the school. We're not at the school right now. We'll be at the school slowly from the 18th. But you can order from Josh, absolutely. Otherwise, just pick it up from Esthetique on Sandy Spring twice a month. And we'll carry on to help support you in your spa and your business because this means so much to me that I want, regardless of, I always say that regardless of where you are in the world or where you're in America, you are my student. It doesn't matter if you didn't go to my school. You will always be my student. I'm like, it's Happy Mother's Day. I'm like the mother of estheticians. <laughs> <laughs> Happy Mother's Day to the mother of us decisions, right? Uh, well, thank you all again. Look out for that email. Um, it's not going to come from MailChimp, but I decided to send it directly, so it'll come to your inbox hopefully. But thank you all again. Uh, have oh. a wonderful day, everybody. So, Josh, one more thing. So the oh. webinar, we're going to tape it, and it'll be on... Um... Oh, yeah, this will be on YouTube. So once I get it uploaded to YouTube, this particular webinar will be available so you can review it again at your leisure. Watch it as many times as you want. You can hear my voice over and over and over again in your own home. <laughs> you can send it to your friends. Um, exactly. So, um, so, yeah, this will be available on YouTube. And, again, it'll be, I'll be in that email I send out to you yeah. either tomorrow and or... Go to elainestoningskincare.com and check us out. All right. Bye, everybody. Happy Friday.